March 1st, the last time Roger was here. It was an eight, Sunday evening, and uh, I had been dealing with an issue with my ankle. I had severe problems. It started out with plantar fasciitis, and then it just turned into a, a whole list of other things. It just set off everything that was wrong in my ankle and just keep, it kept going on. And uh, I had been to the doctor, I went to a, a podiatrist, I went to, and he was unable to take care of what was going on in my ankle, so he sent me to back to my doctor and I went to see an orthopedic surgeon. He had an MRI done and was unsure what to do with it, so he had me see another doctor, another orthopedic, and that guy wasn't sure what to do. He had some blood tests on and on and on, and I was running around with all kinds of stuff. And uh, finally they decided uh, to give me an injection, and they gave me an injection on the inside of my ankle. Uh, it lasted about a week and a half, and then the pain came right back. So I went back right away and I told him, I said, it didn't do anything. And so he decided to give me one on the other side of my ankle, on the outside, a sub tailor joint, which really hurts a lot of doing. But that one only lasted about a week and a half. And about, it was about two weeks after that, that's when March 1st came around, when Roger was here, and we were having the revival at the church. And Roger had a word of knowledge as he was up here praying. He was, we were late in here, so we were sitting at the back. And uh, he was praying for people up front, and then he just stopped. I remember he walked back and forth and did the glory to God. <laughs> and he just paced for a minute and said he had a word of knowledge for anybody with arthritis to stand up. And I guess half the people in the church stood up. And he said, just start working that joint. And I was standing in the back, and I, I couldn't even bend my foot. I, could, I couldn't put weight on it, let alone bend it. And I'd been, from the service that morning, I was up here working at the altar, catching people that were praying. By the time I went home, my ankle had gotten about double the size. And it was hurt really bad. And I was using the crutches when I was at home. And uh, when I came back that night, it was really sore. And I was standing back there, and he said, start bending and working that joint. And I started twisting my ankle and rolling my ankle, and it was gone. It was gone like that. And thank God since. And I ran around the church. It was just awesome. Um, I, I found out, you know, I, I realized what was going on with all this. It was uh, about the time, shortly after, I, God blessed us with our business. It's a fitness center. He, the Satan set this on me, and that's where he was trying to take the glory of God's gift to us and uh, my family and I. And that's when I realized that I wasn't going to let the Satan take this from me. That God was just blessing us that we could keep going in this. And it's just, it was an awesome miracle. There's, uh, you went uh, back to the doctors? Yeah, and I went back to the doctors two weeks after this, after the healing. And when I walked in there without a walking stick, and I wasn't limping, they just looked, they were shocked. They said, so the shots worked? I said, no. I said, I told you, they only lasted about a week and a half. I said, two weeks later, I went to church, we had a revival, and it was a prayer from a word of knowledge, and I said, it was healed. It was instant. I said, it was really sore when I walked in there. And then that was the intern that first took me into the room, and after the intern left, Oh, he, he said, wait a minute, and he went and got the other doctor, the orthopedic surgeon that had been working on my foot. And he brought that doctor back in and said, here, tell him that story. <laughs> so he had me tell him the story over again. And then he left and went and got the other orthopedic surgeon that I got to tell again, because that was the first one that I saw. But uh, it's just a blessing. I said, you know, my wife and I are always active, and we've always done a lot of things together. Her dad is, uh, rides cycles all the time, bicycles. And all last year, all last summer, I didn't get to ride at all. I got to, had to watch them two take off and sit at home. And this year, I'm back on the bike with them. Yesterday, it was yesterday. Yesterday. You drove your bicycle how many miles? 41 miles. When you get to share your testimony, tell what happened when you share your testimony, what happens at your place of business? At, when I'm at the business, you know, I mean, over that whole, it was, 
about a full year that I was in that in that condition where I was limping and hobbling around and I couldn't do anything. And everybody kept <clears throat> noticing that I stopped limping. And every time somebody said, they said, what did the doctors do for you? I said, it wasn't the doctors, it was him that healed me. And I get to tell the whole testimony. And every time that I get to tell that testimony, I can't tell you how many times I've told it, probably 200 times at least. And every time I do, I get new people coming in to sign up. It just happens that day. It just, it's, yeah. it's, it's awesome. Yeah. 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 Yeah.